Hello everyone and welcome to the Game Shed with me, Jamie. Today I'm having a look at Koi Hime Enbu, a 2D anime fighter based on the Koi Hime Musou visual novel. This features 13 different female characters, 7 assist characters, a fatal counter system, a replay mode, one or two players local or online, and is being released May 19th, 2016. This is being published by Dejika, those legends behind the releasing of such greats as Mushihima Sama. It's been developed by Unknown Games and M2 Co Limited, and at time of release is about £24. I've only quickly dipped into this game. I cannot profess to be an expert at it, nor can I state that I am any form of knowledgeable fountain on the Koi Hime Muso visual novel. I have never heard of it before. I am not a visual novel person, but I very much enjoy fighting games and I very, very much enjoy anything that Dejika decide to release into the wild. And look at this artwork, fantastic. Let me know out there in the comment section if you are a fan of the Koi Hime Muso visual novels and if this here game stays true. So let's get cracking. Been chatting long enough. Let's start this bad boy up and I'm just gonna go through um, a few fights and show you exactly what this game looks like. Okay, so here are our 13 characters. And number 13 down in the bottom left. Or you can select a random. Now, I don't know what any of these characters do, so I'm going to just pick a random. There we go. Bacho? Ba bacho, uh, I suppose. Hmm. What's wrong, QE? What are you humming about? Well, actually, QE, if you're holding it, you shouldn't. <laughs> That's right, it's bad for your health to keep holding it. What's she talking about? Is she holding in a Wii? Go ahead. Go. To yes, she was holding in a Wii. Hey, no. Why would you think about the ladies every time I look difficult? So it's not. <laughs> what were you groaning about? I've been thinking for a while, and now I've decided. I'm going on my own quest. What? Why all of a sudden? Well, I just thought that I should see the whole wide world and test myself. Uh, you're so meat-headed. Don't say meat-headed. If you really want to test yourself, why don't we have a match before you go off into the world? I won't push it if you're intimidate, intimidated by me. What do you mean? No way would I be intimidated by you. Okay, let's do it then. Sure. That's all it takes to have a scrap in this world. Okay, man. So I believe I'm using an Xbox 360 wireless controller. I believe X is light, attack, Y is medium, B is strong, and A is special. Um, I think. Let's have a little. Let's have a little go. I'm recording this at 60 FPS, 1080, um, and there's a special weapon. Got some kind of whirlwindy, tornadoy thing. So I'm the girl dressed in black right now. Bosh, she got knocked the F out, man. Do we have a throw move? I've literally played maybe 10 minutes of this so far. I'm liking what I see so far. It's very nice animation. Um, quirky characters by the looks of it. Bosh, knockout. I don't seem to be... Uh, I don't seem to be doing anything too spectacular in uh, in terms of moves. Let's try and bring in my uh, my sub-character. I'm not entirely sure how one does that. Let's try the shoulder buttons. Oh, hello. Horse of power. Yeah. Get down. There's a, there's a whole load of uh, female pro heavy protagonist 2D fighters coming out at the moment. Um... Yeah. How do we bring our bloody partner in? I'll check out the instruction manual. Momentarily. There we go. Three hit. Job done. That's round one or fight one. Done. Win. 
Zing, you had too much Menma. And it slowed you down. Menma. Must be like force. Yay, I won. Okay. On to, on to the next fight. Stage two. More of the same? Fair and square. Right, let's try and pull off something spectacular and magical. I've got to say, it's a very pretty looking game. Have a little one of them in your face. There's a throw. Don't know how I did that. I think I pressed hard and medium. Let's try that again. Yep, hard and medium for a throw. Let's try light and medium. No, that's just one of them in the face. Let's kill her off. Dead. Bosh. Very, very nice looking game. You can jump on Steam and grab this from the 19th of May. At time of recording this, it is the 18th of May. Um, just a kind of first look video. When I get more into it, perhaps I'll bring you a full review and let you know exactly my thoughts behind the game and uh, all of the endings or who knows what can come from this uh, this game. Oh man, she's being troublesome. Bosh. Have one of them. That used one bar of my tactic, as you can see down the bottom, my tactics bar. Um, four in total. And she is no more. Goodbye, Gakushin. Still haven't quite worked out how to bring my partner in. Meh, yeah, that's all good. Okay, on with the next battle. So that was the strength of Bacho. Bacho, I suppose. Oh, hey, pull yourself together. She's fine. She just passed out. Hmm, I need to talk to her. Come on. I want to fight Butterfly Eye. If you want to read this, just pause the video. That sounded rude, whatever she just said. Don't think she likes me. Oh, butterfly eye. Kakoton Genjo. Oh, she looks evil. She don't look happy. Oh, there was a taunt. That was a shoulder button. That was a trigger button. There's my taunt. It's no good taunting if you're not in the lead. And she's stringing together some nice little combos here. And uh, I just got a Steam achievement for that. Not entirely sure uh, if I should be awarded for getting battered. But, you know, each their own. Right, come on, man. Let's, let's try and uh, bring in my partner. If you know how to... How one would bring in the partner, do let me know. I'm probably doing everything wrong, but that's all good. Oh, man. Die, you one-eyed fiend. Oh, helicopter uh, horse attack. Convincing victory. You win. Seems like all my battles are taking place because of a misunderstanding. Liking that horse move. Maybe a little too much. Let's try my special attack, which is A. Okay. How about some shoulder button action? Okay, that's what that does. A little sweep. And one of them to the face. Nice. Ouch. Oh, good block, love. Couldn't block that one. She's so windy, Bacho. So windy. Win! I am the best meat-headed fighter. Isn't she just?
You didn't just get beaten, love. You got absolutely obliterated. Right, we're going to have a last fight. I shan't show you all of the uh, stories going on through this character's uh, arc. I shall let you discover that for yourselves, those of you who are fans of the visual novels. Uh, this will mean a hell of a lot more to you than it does to me. Do get involved in the comment section. Let me know what I'm missing out on by not reading the visual novels. And uh, let me know what it's all about. Kakoan. Right, I've switched. I was using the uh, analog controller. I am now using the... Ouch. Nut kick. Figuratively speaking, obviously. Um... I'm now using the D-pad. Have one of them. Bosh, she is getting mangled. Oh, see. Let's have another horse. Oh, yeah. Sack. Tonk. Dealt with. Nice, 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 nice. Nice. That's right, fall at my feet. You win. How do you guys feel about... Um, there's been more and more and more um, Eastern games being released to a Western audience recently with publishers like uh, Dejika, things like that. Do you think it's a good thing? We can uh, easily now get hold of some of these great titles. Yes, okay, so, ow. So there might be a bit of a delay. Um, but, I mean, other companies like Namco, Bandai, they're uh, also doing their bit. And uh, publishers such as P-Cube. P-Cube bringing out tons and tons of Eastern games to a Western audience. Let me know your thoughts. Is there anything uh, that hasn't been released that you would like to see released to... Oh my god, I'm about to die. No, we're going to give you the Horse of Doom in a second, love. Did I get her? Yeah, smacked her down. There we go. So uh, do remember to hammer the thumbs up button, guys, if you are a fan of this genre. Or uh, just appreciate this video. If you did, then uh, show us some love. So thank you very much for watching, guys, and until the next time, I'll see you later.